Good morning, Saints of Christ, in Jesus' name. We are still on the devotional of Dr. Hill, but today's topic is some things are about your endurance, and this emphasizes that certain struggles are more about enduring through them than um, achieving immediate success. Dr. Hill relates his own experiences with his wife, Paula, where they continue to pray and minister despite challenges they had, understanding that perseverance is crucial. Dr. Hill also encourages us to recognize our struggles as the difficult transition between the past experiences and our destined future. He also highlights David's victory in the book of 1 Samuel 13, when he recovered all things he had lost as an example of God's intervening favor, emphasizing that true recovery absolutely includes emotional and spiritual wholeness, not just the, re the gathering of possessions. So what happened in the book of 1 Samuel 30? What actually happened was then when, when David came back um, to Siklach on the third day, he came to a place that was utterly destroyed by the Amalekites. The Amalekites came um, when David and his men wasn't there. They took everything. Uh, the, the captive, uh, the, the, they took everything. Nothing was left. And David and his men wept. They wept and cried like babies. But then David picked himself up and he said to his men, let's follow these men. We can still find them. And then in verse 18, so David recovered all that the Amalekites had taken and rescued his two wives also. And he rescued everybody else's wives, of course. So despite the lengthy and tough periods of our waiting, Dr. Hill assures us that even like in the Amos paradigm of, of accelerated favor will bring about recovery and restoration of what was lost to spiritual attacks. He also, he also promises that peace and joy will return, says God. He promises that this joy will be ours, and what the enemy intended to harm us about, he will overturn it and bless us. Shalom.